Hey guys, Nova Explosion. Welcome back to more Wild Arms 5. Let's talk about the Golden Angels that we got. We have two of them, I think. Yeah, two Golden Angels. Now, I believe there are 12 Golden Angels scattered throughout the world, and that equivalates to two costumes per character. I did some research and got all the list of the characters I need to talk to. We have two of them, so I think the characters we're going to go to are... Well, actually, you'll see in a minute. We're gonna go find two characters right now and grab their costumes. So, I'm going to Honey's Day. And after that, we'll go to Gonon. Yeah, I am hoping we could tackle more seal bosses today is kind of on the agenda. We'll see if that actually happens, though. All in good fun, though. Ba -ba -ba -bum -bum -bum. Actually thinking, do I want to wear Dean's dark coat? Maybe I do. Although for now, this is fine. We're going to end up changing it soon because we have Jet here. Hey, that's a golden angel you've got, isn't it? Well, I was given an item in the ruins of a certain research lab, told to trade it away whenever I found someone with that angel. So how about it? Trade the golden angel for the red guard, armor forged from the memories of Felgaia, created to serve the world's warriors. Yes. So we got the red guard. Well, there's a load off my back. I don't know if that thing will help you at all, but don't let it go to waste, okay? Now, this gets us a costume for Dean. And I guess the fact that Jet gives it to us, you can kind of guess what it means. We get Jet's outfit from Wild Arms 3. So this is where the cameos come in, which is really cool. So now Dean can wear Jet's outfit, and I gotta say, it looks really good on Dean. Good pick for a Jet giving a costume to Dean. Now, I want to go to Gonon and talk to someone for Avril's, one of Avril's outfits. I think that's what I'm going to do. Actually, if I go to Gonon, I can pick between Avril and Greg. I'm probably going to get Avril, Greg, and Dean's... Or, I'll get Avril and Greg a costume first, and then we'll get the others. Because we're not really using Carol, Chuck, and uh, Rebecca. We'll probably... Maybe we'll use them for Raga Regula. Maybe they'll be strong enough, and I can actually make use of them. Because by then, I won't be exchanging their levels as much. Oh, what was I going to do? Gonon? Yeah, Gonon. Go to Gonon. Also, we should go to Cabin Valley and talk to Kanon. I wanted to talk to her last time, but I forgot where she was. We should finally do that today. Now, we can talk to Gallows or Cecilia. I think I'm going to choose Cecilia for now. That's one of the Golden Angels that the Guardians taught me about, isn't it? Well, I'm going to convey the sincerest gratitude to the Guardians for punishing a beast that sought to harm Gaia. As their representative, I would be honored to offer you a reward for your efforts. Yes, we get a robe of Gaia. Thank you very much. This robe was given to a distant ancestor of mine by the Ice Queen herself. It will surely be of great use to you. Now, this is Cecilia's outfit. Oh, I love the color scheme. Oh, this is what you wore in the prologue. That's interesting. So it's not your... It's because in Wild Arms 1, Cecilia like, cuts her hair and changes outfits. This is what you wore in the uh, prologue. That's, that's still pretty sick. Cecilia, one of the best heroines in Wild Arms history. Anyway, we got those costumes. So now I want to try and tackle some more seal bosses. We fought the K-Sara Sarah and the Ape Man Junma. So I think now we'll go to Hillside Ruins. Actually, no. Let's go to Cabin Valley and talk to Kanan first. I just forgot. <laughs> I also do want to go to Mythos Mire because there's a badge I think we're going to need for some of the uh, optional bosses. Also, I didn't realize it. We might actually use Asgard for some of the bosses. I should try it. Because I realized that some of the bosses seem ridiculous because of... Um, Needing to use Asgard. Is Kana not here? Things end up working out okay. Will humans get to go around for a guy all they want? We won't have to give, give her any permission for anything. Deal with their ridiculous tests and red tape. That'd be awesome. I better get my itinerary all squared away now before the crowd builds up. Where is Kana? Is she not here? I thought Kana was here. I guess Kana isn't here. 
could have sworn could have sworn she was in a uh, cabin valley. Very, very weird. We'll find her eventually, though. Maybe she doesn't appear until we get all the things. It's not Orsayos, is it? I'm gonna double check here, and then we'll go to the hillside. But yeah, looking at the list of things we have to do, we have a, a lot of seal bosses to knock out. We have to knock out most of the seal bosses. We still have to do Tartarus and Abyss, but Tartarus and Abyss are probably the last two things we're gonna do. Here's Loka. I don't know where Kanan is, but we'll find her eventually. Maybe there's like a, maybe like Loka, there's a gimmick to finding her or something. I don't know. Uh, where's Hillside? Right here. We're going here next. But, um, we have a lot of pillar bosses to take care of. That's, that's the bulk of what we need. We still have a few puzzle boxes. We're not going to do any puzzle boxes today, but... We still have a couple of seal bosses. We have a couple of uh, puzzle boxes to knock out. There's like a few little... Oh, this is where we were at the start of the game. That's neat. We have a couple of... Oh, I don't have the Soul Nitro here. Really? Really? I find that a little hard to believe, but whatever you say. Um, what was I saying? Yeah, we'll get all the puzzle boxes done. We're not going to do any today. Seal bosses. We have a couple of little, like, side quests, as it were. Like, a couple of fetch fetch quests, like, finding people to do for a little quest. But we have a little quest line to do. We have Zed's quest to do. Those shouldn't take very long. I'm kind of focusing more on the seal bosses right now. I think the last two things we're going to do are Tartarus and Abyss, though. Those are, like, the last two things we'll do. I'm not too worried about those. What I'm surprised about is I don't have this Soul Niger. I could have sworn I, uh, I got it. Or maybe you weren't able to go any farther in this, uh, area. Okay, yeah, maybe we weren't op able to open this door. Yeah, it's blue. That makes a lot more sense. We couldn't come back here way sooner, but, ah, whatever. But that makes more sense why I don't have the Soul Niger. Oh, this is a throwback to the start of the game. It's so nice. Anyway, I really want to get these post games done because I want to play Alter Code F. But I can't play Alter Code F until I get the Wild Arms games post games complete. Yeah, I knew that would happen. Can I pull this? It won't reach. All right. Yeah, I really want to play Alter Code F in the near future, so I got to get these post games done. And I did start replaying 4 again. Because uh, you've in 4, you have to do like a second playthrough to do all the content in it. Unfortunately. Uh, where's Detector? Air's Detector. It's green. Can we find anything? But, um, I want to play Alter Code F soon, so I want to get these post games like in the books. As soon as I can. Yeah. Bum, bum, bum. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that'll be happening soon, Alter Code F. Literally, probably as soon as I'm done recording these post games. The post games don't need to be on YouTube, but as soon as I'm done recording the post games for Form 5, we are looking at an Alter Code F playthrough in the near future. At the very worst, though, it'll happen this year for sure. Because I want to play it so badly. I love Wild Arms. This way. There we go. See, I saw Hillside Ruins, and I didn't realize it was actually this location. Like, the very first location of the game. And that's something I didn't realize. Can we find anything? This is a grapple hook puzzle. It did nothing. Okay. Oh, because I have to go here first. That makes more sense. Duplicator chest. Do I have enough duplicators to open this? I hope so. I 
Curly and Buster. Ah, how? So... Power shot? How would that help me? It wouldn't. I feel like I can't do anything in this room. It doesn't look like I can. Hmm. Maybe in this room there's something to detect? Um. What, what area am I in? Area 14? Oh, I need to- okay, I see, I see. I didn't realize freezing it would let me grab onto it. That makes more sense, though. So, what we need to do is power shot, then freeze, then anchor. All right. That'll do it. And then I can burn this to... No, thank you. That makes more sense. I didn't realize freezing it would allow me to do that. That makes more sense, though. Ba, ba, bum. This one? Oh, I need another. Okay. Hmm. I can't push these up, though. Power shot? Yeah, I won't go. Oh, I see, I see. Maybe I have to, like... Okay, I think I see. That was bad. <laughs> Lock onto it. Oh, let's go. I'm a gamer. Bum, 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 bum. Area seventeen. Ooh, hello. Is there no Soul Niger here? Where's the Soul Niger at? Maybe there is no- there's no encounter, so maybe there's no Soul Niger. That would make sense, actually, now that I think about it. Stand before you, all of you clothed in the spirit of- Oh, do I have to wear school uniforms for this? What's that supposed to mean? I guess I have to wear school uniforms for this. So... the Sheik suit... You already have the Black Boncho... You could wear the wrapping. You could wear the light or black. Just wear black. Last president's good. Silver blazer is good. Junior green is good. All right. Oh, was all right. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Dean's always supposed to say that. All right, so now I can switch them back. Mostly Dean and Avril matter. I want you to be in the robe with Phil Gaia. I want you to be. You keep the black poncho. We'll get you a uniform next. And I want you to be in Jet's outfit.
Alright, while well, here. Oh, save point. Thank you, game. Wow, really appreciated. Yeah. Here we go. We'll sign it up. I'll stamp out each and every one of you. Alright, buddy. See what you're made of. Mechaton attack. Easy dodge. Oh wow, you have very little HP. Holy cow, that experience. You're weak to fire. You have very little HP, which is interesting. Let's try to get Greg on the um fire when they set. Go here. Can't do that, but I'm gonna hyper. Let's bust him up! You have a lot less HP compared to the other two I just fought. It must be done. Avril, go I'll here move. so he can't take over water and just get on him with the Violator attacks. Dude, the Robofill guy is so nice on Avril. It's so cool. I love it a lot. Oh no, not just stream. What's this do? Poison? That won't work. No effect. Let's go. Go here. Footwork's real important here. And high blast. Okay, I'm doing little damage. This is probably a case of like he has really high defense. Get ready for meltdown. Well, even still, we're not doing like a little bit of damage. Damage is still a lot. Get ready for meltdown. He's a lot less bulky than the other two. Please move. Yes, please move. You're in the way. Die. As this goes on, think about which one I want to fight next. Huh. Oh, he just healed. That's why they give him a little bit of HP. I mean, that's fine. I think as long as I'm out damaging him. So I'll probably have Dean intrude or something. As long as I'm out damaging him, the heal should not be a problem. Is what I'm thinking. I actually really want to intrude. I think I will. Still got the magic and attack up, which is good. Yeah, this is fine as long as I out damage him. You're on a roll now. Indeed, we're on a roll. Uh, heavy crush. And I'll have Avril get in there to physical attack. Wow, this one's like really easy compared to the other two. I was probably meant to fight this one first, but that was the breaks, I guess. It'd be that way. My old power has returned. Here I go. There we go. Did you kill? No, you almost did though. One more? Aw, oh, rip. Alright, Greg. You'll all be ashes soon enough. Right now. I'm gonna do more than just singe ya. Oh, you live that. It's a good thing I hit you again. Oh, wait. Okay, yeah, it just shows you... It looked like he had one HP, but he didn't. Nice. Alright, well, that was an easy one. We got it done. <laughs> I've still gotta become stronger. Lots of experience. Avril is very close to level 100. I think 100's the max level? It's the max level in Wild Arms 3. I never got max level in 1 and 2. In 3, I got the max level. It was 100. So I imagine it's also 100 in this game. Beautiful. Save the game. Now, let's go to... Well, actually, let's go get Greg in outfit. I have to choose between Gallows and Jack. Gallows and Jack are the two outfits that Greg gets. Probably gonna choose Gallows. What the? Controller, please. You might find something new let's this go time. grab Gallows' outfit. 